everybody and welcome back to my channel. I'm Crystal and this is This Provincial Life. Today I'm going to be doing a spoiler free review of The Great Alone by Kristen Hanna. And so let's just jump right in. So Kristen Hanna, this is the second book I've read by her and I read uh, The Nightingale by her and it is my all time favorite book of 2017 or 2016. I don't even remember which year it was, but it was amazing. It's all about World War II and sisters and how they respond differently to the World War II. And I loved it. Uh, I highly recommend it if you like World War II novels. But enough about that. Let's talk about The Great Alone. So The Great Alone follows three people. So it follows Lenny, who is a teenage girl with bright red hair. And then we have Cora, who is Lenny's mother, and then Ernt, who is Lenny's father. This book is placed in the 1970s in Seattle at first. And then it follows them as they decide to move to the Alaskan bush and basically live off of the land in hopes to kind of use this as a way to start over. They've been having some problems within their families and within like uh, just personally, and they've just been having a lot of issues. And so it, it is during the Vietnam War or uh, soon after the Vietnam War. So that kind of plays into it as well. And it's just about them learning about themselves while they're living in Alaska and trying to survive, trying to learn about who they are, and then also making connections with their families and with the people that they find around them, and then also learning how to like survive because it is an extremely unforgiving territory and not a lot of people survive. It's so common for people to disappear and and to just not show up one day. I loved this book. Like, I listened to it in audiobook, highly recommend it. The voice was amazing. From the very second I pressed play, I was sucked in, which is very rare for me in audiobooks. Sometimes it takes me a couple of chapters to kind of get used to the, to the, uh, the voice you know, and the voices, but she was so natural. She made the, the male voices sound really real. She made the women voices not sound too squeaky and juvenile. And it just like, it sucked me in. And I, I think it's a 13 hour long audiobook, and I think I finished it in two days. So I was like hooked. And the character development was flawless. Like every single person made like, made improvements or they digress like the character development was flawless the pacing was flawless it just it kind of read a lot like a thriller because it's just kind of like are they going to survive what are they going to do next and you know the antagonist being the wild and there's also some other antagonist type situations as well that aren't necessarily the world the uh, Alaskan bush and then the writing style, like I love Kristen Hanna's writing style. It gives you enough information, but it doesn't give you too much where you feel like it's bogged down. Like you want to read every word because it's just so beautifully written. And I 100% loved the writing style. The plot was amazing. Like you understood why they're doing what they're doing and you want them to succeed, but you also don't know if they're going to. And it has like that element of mystery and an intrigue that just makes a book so amazing and I give this gave this book five out of five stars I would recommend this to anybody that likes literary fiction it is just mm, it is so good I would recommend this to men I would re recommend this to women I would recommend this to someone younger I would recommend this to to anybody it is just so well done it isn't like watered down they are really truly explaining it very well they explain um, the area really well. It seemed like Kristen Hanna really knew this area and did her research and really knew what it felt like and what it was really like to live in this area. If this intrigues you, I would 100% recommend this. I love it. And if you have read it, um, I will leave my spoiler review above so you can... Strider, you know. So 
if, you, if this intrigues you and you've already picked up the book and you've read it, go ahead and click the i card and you can go and watch my spoiler review where I go into more detail about why I love this story so much. And if you haven't, like, go read this book and then go watch that because this book literally, like, I think Kristen Hanna it has become my all-time favorite author. And that's, all, that's saying a lot after only two books, but like if all of her books have as much power and as much like perfectness, if I can say that, uh, but then I will, I will buy all of her books and just like pound through them because she is awesome. Okay, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. But otherwise, I'll see you next time. Bye.